Hello YouTubers, today's hero is Queen Battery QB18500, a 1600mAh rated lithium-ion battery of 18500 size, which can be discharged at up to 1.6 amps. 18500 batteries have the same diameter as the popular 18651s, but are 15mm shorter. Their length is 50mm compared to 65 in case of 18650. Well, let's take a look at my testing conditions and pass to the results of the test. All the tests were done using a special battery tester, the ZKE Tech EBC820, which supports 4 wire measurement, discharge current up to 20 amps, and it can be connected to a PC for building graphs. I've upgraded my battery holder to the version 3.0. I have made contact pads from 0.5mm pure copper sheet. The positive terminal is 9mm wide and the width of negative terminal is 11.5mm. The pads are designed to provide good connection even with batteries which have deep placed positive or negative contacts. I've followed all the prescriptions of the IEC 61960 standard concerning battery's capacity measurement. The surrounding air temperature was 20-25 centigrade and before each discharging cycle the battery was charged at its standard charging current which is mentioned in its datasheet and after that it was left for one hour minimum, as the standard requires. After this charging cycle, the battery was again left for one hour minimum. I buy my batteries from Queen Battery, which is my reliable supplier of genuine batteries. They offer individual approach to each customer and special discounts depending on the quantity you buy. You can find a link to their website and their sales manager's email in the description under this video. The marking on the heat shrink tube of this battery shows only the model number, nominal capacity and nominal voltage. Here are the main specifications from its official datasheet. Nominal capacity 1600 mAh, nominal voltage 3.7 volts, standard charge current 320 mA, maximum charge current 800 mA. Charge and voltage 4.2 volts. Maximum continuous discharge current 1.6 amps. Discharge cutoff voltage 2.75 volts. AC impedance less than 80 milliohms. Weight about 42 grams. Pay attention to the standard charge current. It's only 0.2C, which means that you're gonna charge it for about 5 hours. The measured weight of my cell was 43.7 grams, and the measured DC internal resistance measured at 1.6 amps in fully charged condition was around 51 milliohms. At 0.2C or 0.42 amps, Queen Battery QB18500 gave out 1728 mAh or 4309 mWh. At 1 amp discharge rate, the result was 1659 mAh or 5926 mWh. At its maximum 1.6 amps, 1624 mAh or 5694 mWh. The capacity test showed very good results and beautiful curves. At 0.2C the capacity is noticeably higher than declared, and even at 1.6 amps it remains above 1600 mAh. The only disadvantage of this guy is its low standard charge current. That's all about QB18500. Hit the like button if you find this video interesting, subscribe to my channel and click on the bell next to the subscribe button to be notified about new videos. Bye bye!